Hello, this is Mark Sabatella from Outside Shore Music, home of Mastering MuseScore. In this week's tip, I want to show you how to color notes, how to literally add color. I've been talking about color tones in a musical sense. Now I want to talk about color in the actual notation sense, a note that is red or green or yellow or blue. And I'm going to show you how you can do that in MuseScore. So I've got a score up here, and let's say I want to take this D here. This is a D major chord, and I'm just going to change the pitch to E. Um, and it, it's blue right now because it's selected. You're all probably accustomed to that, but as soon as I unselect it, it's black. Well, if I want to make this kind of permanently colored, say maybe make it purple or something so that I remember, hey, that's a color tone. It's, it's the ninth of that chord or the second. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here to the Properties panel and then click on Appearance. And then at the bottom of that panel, you'll see the color selector. And it defaults to black, but I can pick any other color I want, including a variety of purples. And I can select that. And uh, when I close the dialog, the note is still blue, but that's because it's still selected. As soon as I click off, off of that note, we'll see that now it is purple. So you can select as many notes if, as you want. If I want to select, say, all of these A's here, I can select those three A's and uh, then come over to the Properties panel, go over to Appearance, and I could mark them yellow to say, oh, those are just chord tones, right? And again, they look blue right now because they're still selected, but as soon as I click off of them, they're yellow. Now, you can go through and add as much color as you want that way. If you want to reset everything back to where it was, you can do that all at once. You can select, say, that whole measure or the whole score for that matter, go back to appearance, and you'll see that under color, it's got a little question mark in here indicating that, hey, these, these are a mixture of different colors, but under that dot, dot, dot menu, there is a reset. And when I do that, everything is reset to the default color. Again, looks blue, but as soon as I click off of it, you can see it is back to black. So that is how you can color notes in MuseScore.